On to a story of just what technology can do. Nature can sometimes be cruel to sickly or disabled animals. But despite a bum leg, a baby chick is getting to put one foot in front of the other. 13 News reporter Dan Thorne explains. Bumbles here is a month old chicken with seemingly normal behavior. Except there is something a little different. A foot hooked upward, making life difficult for the chick. But that was before imagination had any say in the matter. He has been able to thrive this far, so we were wondering how we could help him uh, become, like, to move around like a, a normal chicken would. Megan Salter teaches a program for talented and gifted students. She says the fifth graders used their talents to create a gift for their feathered friend. They were working hard, they came up with all these amazing sketches, and we wanted to take what their passion was and make it a reality. Bumble's deformity is a result of a slip tendon. The chick was likely doomed before well-being came in the form of a 3D printed leg. You can tell by the flapping that Bumble's sometimes stumbles with his new limb. However, the students are not giving up on coming up with something better. I try to encourage him. Like if I see him, like he, like sometimes instead of him perching there, he'll kind of try to use it and kind of try to walk around a little bit, which it makes me proud because this is only his second day with it on. The Robert C. Bird Institute provided the tools for the prosthetic. The creation is a combination of all the students' ideas. All right, I get it. You may be thinking, why do all of this for a baby chicken? But to these students, the transformation is something more. This could actually save his life because we didn't think that he would make it, but he's four weeks old now and he's doing great. It is showing them kindness and it's also showing them how they can make a difference in the world. The class is hoping at some point Bumbles will get the strut down like his friend Namaste. In Huntington, Dan Thorne, 13 News, working for you. Oh, Bumbles. All right, the students and their teachers credit the custodian at Central City Elementary School with coming up with the 3D leg idea in the first place.